Hello friends, I'm Colonel Failure and this is Transport Fever Mainline. You're joining me here on board the recently added food train as we go through the scene of last episode's crime uh, where it's very, very quiet at the moment. It's too quiet. I don't trust it. But anyway, I probably should trust it. It's only quiet because uh, we haven't done today's episode yet. Uh, once we have done today's episode, it should be quite a lot more noisy. Um, anyway, I've just set this train to, uh, to auto-replace uh, because, uh, as was correctly pointed out in the comments, uh, it is hauling one boxcar that can only handle 120 kilometers an hour, uh, whereas the locomotive and everything else will do 160. Uh, so I've set that to replace as soon as we get into the next station. But I thought, hey, you know what? Because that's, that's how I sound. Uh, what, what, why don't we start out with a nice little train journey uh, over this horrendous piece of track? Um, and, uh, and then, if I time it absolutely right, uh, we'll arrive uh, into Arkham at such a point that I can transition and show... Come on... The number of trucks that are waiting to pick up food to deliver throughout the town and highlight the innovative truck route that I have set up in order to make that happen. This is painful. Come on. Uh, we're almost there. Uh, here we go. This is Arkham now. And, uh, and I just wanted to highlight uh, while we were here, completely seamless, they spotted nothing, uh, the number of trucks... Uh, that I've got com coming into the station here uh, to make pickups of the uh, of the prepared food, which is what this will have when it comes back the other way. Um, I have I've done a slightly innovative route here. I did this will come as a surprise to you, I'm sure. In the it's a single route, but it's got uh, it it does a to and fro, right? Uh, as as we like. Uh, if I call the route up, you'll you'll see exactly what I've done here. It's, uh, it's, uh, uh, call up the right route. That's a good start. Um, so basically, what I did is I looked for all the areas that had uh, high density of uh, of commercial going on and made sure that we had a stop at each one. So it's like, you know, I'd quite like this to develop a little bit further. Uh, Dogwood here is making sure that's delivered. Johnson is obviously the central business district. Uh, and then we've got one up here. Now, obviously, they're on uh, they're on split levels there as well. Uh, I, I admire the tenacity of this particular uh, individual who has decided to, uh, to plumb themselves in fairly high up. Anyway, this route is working out really quite nicely. The interesting thing, and it is interesting, be quiet, uh, is that uh, we've got uh, uh, grain waiting here as well, but actually I'm about to stop shipping grain. Uh, it's going to be cattle only. But the interesting thing is that what I should also be doing is sending a second train down here to go and process some food and whip it back just to this station instead of dropping it at Arkham. Because in so doing, what I'll uh, what I'll create is uh, the opportunity for secondary markets, and secondary markets is what we're about today, friends. Is uh, is we're going to develop the other goods lines here, and uh, and and see if we can't uh, can't come up with something somewhat impressive. I say somewhat because it's me. Now, before we kick off, I'm going to caveat today's adventure. Uh, with a with a bit of a caution in that I've not planned this through completely. I know it's come as a shock to us all. Uh, I have not completely thought through uh, what we're going to get up to today. I've got a broad outline, and uh, and hopefully that will work. Here are the new wagons, as you can see, and uh, that should allow the train to run a little faster. Uh, it's I mean it's not short to making a couple of quid though. It's already made. Th I mean, thirteen million is a a very nice state of affairs there um so lots of hope for this uh, for this particular train and uh, it does actually exceed the length of the platform which is less than ideal uh it's 400 and something meters in length uh but it's got a I, i've changed up the locomotive as well i put a, a more suitable uh american uh, electric on the front of that uh right anyway let's let's get on with it because i've got quite a lot to do and we want to see it pan out um 
So first things first is I'm going to run from New New York to here and back again with something approaching a universal car. Uh, I, am I approaching a new universal car? Uh, yes. What does that mean in real terms? Well, it, in real terms, it means uh, something uh, like we're running on the main line that has a little bit of flexibility about it. Uh, so we'll uh, we'll duplicate up one of these and uh, and see what we get. But it's gonna it's gonna run a shuttle service, which means that it has the likelihood of interfering with our uh, uh, our ore distribution. So the, the, this chap is picking up uh, co uh, not copper iron. There you go, iron ore at the moment. Um, but uh, but obviously this service is going to run in and out of the same platform as that, uh, but not at this end. Uh, the only question really is, where is it going to go? Um, because that's... Is that suitable? Is anybody else using that? Let's have a look. Yes. Oh. Dear. Um, right. Okay, well that's that's not ideal. We don't want to be blocking other lines. What would be perfect here is to get over onto this side. Uh, but I have not, because that's coming in over, via the flyover look. Um, I've got lots of lovely empty platforms there. I, ooh, ah, okay, well, there's nothing like starting with a, a complex junction to, to get the pulse racing. So uh, let's do that, shall we? Prepare your pulse accordingly. Uh, it's about to start racing. Uh, so what we'll do is we'll try and get <laughs> on this tight corner here. Well, there is no doubt also changing in elevation. This is easy. Uh, we will attempt uh, to to break a junction off there, and uh, and we'll keep that on the flat. This is something that I've I've recently had some luck with. Is uh, is creating flat junctions. It makes for a less ugly uh, track solution. So if we go off at uh, an angle like that initially, uh, that we shouldn't have a problem when it comes to uh, uh, the traffic facing off against one another. Although obviously they can't rule that out. Uh, we'll stick one ways on just uh, just to you know prepare for the worst, uh, like so, and then we'll uh, we'll head down here and try and get a merger off. I think, actually, underneath this uh, this bridge would probably work nicely. And there's a signal here waiting already. Uh, we'll get rid of that signal, though, because that's about to be superfluous. Uh, right, so something like that. There you go. Look, I mean, 100 kilometers an hour, that's not too bad at all. Uh, we'll keep it on the flat while we do this, and then it can have its, uh, it can have its moment of adjustment afterwards. Uh, pick that up here and around the corner and everybody's happy good now I don't even need to slip those junctions that's a straightforward um, junction is there should you have another adjective in there no 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 that will suffice uh, fine in which case as long as this connects up in one go which it should and has uh, then uh, then that's going to that's probably going to work I, I have to say probably because anything could happen. Um, right, so if we tell old purple here to come in, let's let's bring it right away around the far side. So whichever the highest uh, platform is, go there. Perfect. Well, that worked. Well, I'm 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 shocked, and uh, and more than a little. No, I'm not shocked at all. That, I mean, it was always it was always having a chance at working. We'll stick one signal there for queuing services. That tunnel should be long enough to absorb most trains. Uh, and then we'll stick another, we won't one way this one, we'll stick another signal on the way out. And we'll do that on all of them because all four of these platforms are going to be backing services. Um, oh, I've spotted a problem. Uh, yeah, yeah, you have. Uh, the problem I've spotted is that this platform here can't back properly. Um, and I don't think I've got an easy solution to that. You'd have to you'd have to snake in a very quick junction there to make that work. Ah, oh, that's a that's a pain. Unless we reserve that one for going the other way. I mean, it, it, there was the possibility that I had a uh, had a goods route that went the other way as well. And you know what? Three should be plenty. 
<laughs> ah, should it though? Should it be plenty? You think? Do you think that's going to be plenty? Do you? Yeah, I'm committing to this as a course of action right now. Um, do it the other way. You always, you'll always do a little better if you go the other way. Uh, all right. Well, you, you just whip that over there. Yep. That's it. There you go. It hasn't created any ugly by the tunnel mouth, which makes a change. Uh, and then, uh, and then just just fling this up onto that one. There you go. That's. I mean, that's a bit of a wiggler. Look, we'll go. We'll stick with practical for the moment, um, and then we'll we'll change up as the need arises later on. So there you go. That's that working. And this is just going to be. I don't really know what I'd call it. Um, well, let's call it supply. Uh, no, no, I'm going to call it. I'm going to call it shuttle, despite the fact that breaks all my naming conventions. Uh, New New York Two uh, at one. Um, yeah, because I don't know what it's going to do. I don't know if it's going to uh, deliver anything at all. I don't know if it's going to have any demand. I don't know anything uh, of of that kind of ilk. And it's certainly not going to do anything immediately. Uh, but I am going to set the train in motion as quickly as possible so that we actually see it. Uh, percolate as the episode progresses. Yes, percolation of trains is, is what it's all about. Come on, I called up the train menu already. This shouldn't take you all day. I, I already did. I prepared. I made it so that I didn't have to do filling commentary while you were, you know, debating all of the various locomotives that I've got. Uh, we'll run this uh, this Class 86 here because, uh, because I'm going, oh, oh, oh will we? Yes, because that's what I'm running on the rest of that line. Now then, freight-wise, we either go with... Uh, where are we? Not the bathtub. It's uh, it's these long gondolas here, which is a, a raw material specialist. I think we might end up doing a combination, you know. Okay, right. Well, you've got 400 metres to play with. What are you going with, combinationally? Um, I mean, the good news on this is that we can always duplicate up the trains. Uh, two, three, four, five. So we'll take this up to 200 metres. There you go. And then we'll stick the other one that we've been using. Well, what do these do? Uh, food, goods, tools, machines, good. Yeah, oil. But they don't do fuel. What's the use of it then? If you're not if you're not going to carry fuel as well, I mean, oh, flipping heck. I'm not going to I'm not going to stick a, a dedicated fuel effort on there. What about you lot? No, you're you're worse. You carry even less. Uh, well, do you want to just stick a couple of fuel cars on the on the back end of it? Cuz you're actually you've got something that ships fuel because you uh, you do quite a lot of that. So so what is it that uh, you've got that that you're flinging fuel around with? Uh, I don't know. Actually, I, I could not honestly tell you what I'm using. I was pretty sure it was the containers that were doing it. Uh, you take fuel. I don't trust you, though. Um, oh, it's the Gunderson. Right, there we go. Yeah, sorry. I'm, I'm back on board again. Uh, right, so we'll get this up to 400 metres. Uh, like that. And, uh, and we will then hope for the best. <laughs> hope for the best really oh you've you've clearly thought a lot of this uh through right okay there you go you go and get to work there um there you go let's uh let's just say howdy howdy uh you've you're, you're pulling a gondola that's the same size as the loco that's always a good sign um right okay so it's got plenty of capacity on board and if there is any demand at new new york or if there is any supply uh, then we will fulfill that. Right, okay, now then, while that's going, let's get the next thing moving. And uh, and that's going to be this uh, this tools manufactorum here. Uh, it's called Archimanix at the moment, and it's not, it's Blastech. So let's rename that accordingly, uh, Blastech. Right, and uh, what are you going to do with that? We, well, we're just going to run some trucks. And we'll, we will run trucks up to the uh, the interchange here this is an easy route okay uh yeah it's not worth it's not worth running trains up here it's too short a route so uh, we'll go from blast tech up to the uh the arkham branch there really that's that's not a good name um right so that's going to be uh supply and it is uh blast blast tech 
Uh, you know what? Uh, arc. Uh, uh, no, 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 wait. Arc, yes, hub. There we go. Right, that's what I'm calling it. That's This is now Arc Hub. Uh, you get a new name. Beg your pardon. Arc Hub. Um, and uh, you, you also get a name, and that is going to be Arc Hub uh, Road. Uh, right, okay, now then, that's 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 good. Now then, put some uh, truck. If you say now then one more time, I'm going to hurt you. Um, so if we now fling a couple of trucks on there, we'll start with, I don't know, let's, let's start with two because I'm not delivering anything of the sort at the moment. Uh, I've still got to work that out and, and get it rolling. So we'll just buy two of those and stick it on supply arc hub. Supply. Yes, Arc Hub begins with an A. Thank you. Except uh, it's Blast Tech Arc Hub, which begins with a B. Right. Okay. There you go. They're going to start doing their thing. Um, I, they're not going to accomplish anything for now. Not until I get my acting gear. Uh, but theoretically, we could pull all of these materials from uh, from New New York, and uh, and then get a, a tools and machines business rolling. Do we think that's likely? Nope. Uh, right, okay, next line uh, is going to be uh, going from uh, the Arc Hub here out to... What do I fancy next? Uh, let's go here. Yeah, let's go here. There you go. Uh, out to Acme. Now, Acme makes goods. Okay, fine. Cool. So, uh, so this is going to be supply. Yeah. Uh, uh, Arc Hub. No, 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 you do the other way around. Acme. Uh, Acme, big pardon, Arc Hub, right. Good. Now then, what do we need on there? Uh, we you need uh, planks and plastic and steel and goods. Okay. Now I think those those kind of upright wagons might do that. Uh, hold on. Before you go over there, go and make sure you've you've chosen an appropriate platform. That's an unexpected platform. How have you ended up going that way? Where does this one go? Where does that one go? Oh, that one goes out there as well. Oh, you've got both sides of the track available. Oh, this is uh, this is interesting. Um, right, okay. It's taken the short route, basically, is, is the way it's gone. Now, we've already got a backing service here, and that's going to be the food... No, we haven't... Yeah, it is a backing service. That's going to be the food route, so we definitely don't want it to go on there. Uh, we'll send that out to seven... Not Acme. There you go. Seven, please. There we go. Right. If I can avoid having more than one wire... Oh, okay. It was just a bit of perspective-based uh, based confusion there. Uh, yes. Uh, let's just do visible only. Hold everything. What's going on here? What's, uh, what's this green route? Have I already set this in motion? It looks like I, I jolly well might have done. Supply Blastec Arkham Hub. I'd already set that in motion, you know. All right, that's two separate routes. Uh, well, we ought to we ought to kill one of them, shouldn't we? Wow, how did I how did I miss that? Um, well, it's because I probably set that up last time and I didn't didn't double check it. So uh, so yeah, I, I had the crazy idea of you know what? Let's run two trucks on there to start with and see what happens. Bizarrely, uh, we've already gone for that. Right, let's uh, let's go sell those and then uh, kill that line. Uh, we only want one line on there for the moment. Right. Good, excellent, smashing, moving on. No, not moving on. You need a train. And, uh, and it's all the raw materials for goods is what you want to ship out through there. So let's, uh, let's buy ourselves another train. What are we going to run on that one? Uh, right, well... I don't know, but it, I mean, we're, you know, I'm a sucker for a, for a, a, anything American of the uh, locomotive. But no, you know what? The uh, let's uh, let's bang on something from the uh, the southern hemisphere. Uh, this looks progressive rail LDP class number one, 115 kilometers an hour. It's not that quick, is it? We've got a 160 kilometer an hour uh, electric running up there. So I'll take something in the in the region of 120 to 140. That wouldn't be a deal breaker, but I don't think you're going to deliver, are you? 
No, I think I'm going to have to find something a little more swift. No, they're all they're all the same. It's the same locomotive with some different paint on it. <sighs> oh well. Uh, right. What are you What are you for? You're a passenger loco, uh, quite obviously, uh, despite being a diesel here in the 26th century. Um, so that's that's not going to cut it. Uh, do we want to put another electric on there? What about this? What about this BR number? We haven't used that yet, but we can uh, we could take out the uh, uh, the Australian with the Garn there, um, except that's slower. In which case, you might as well use one of the diesels. But where they ha where they do have an advantage is that they do have a little bit more uh, get up and go. Hold on, this might do the trick. Uh, this eighty two class that is uh, that is without name or persona. And uh, I, I just pushed the button there without really giving it any thought at all, going, ah, I'll be fine. Uh, right, okay, so we're, uh, what I'm thinking is probably the, where are we, these chaps here. Uh, logs, steel, planks, yes. Uh, well, it's, it's steel and planks we want, plus goods and plastic, which you're not doing. I need one that will do the lot. Uh, what have we got here? Steel, planks, yeah, plastic, goods. Good, 100 kilometers an hour, bad. Oh, come on, someone someone will play ball, surely. Uh, steel, planks, nope. Uh, I mean, I don't, you know, I don't want to use a complete universal on it. What about the you chaps? Tools, food, goods. Yeah, just, just goods and plastic for you. Well, we could always put, uh, put a combo together. Really? You think... Yeah, you could do like a couple of those and then uh, a few of these. That'll look nice. You, you know you're mixing all kinds of nationalities together there and uh, and you know that's that's not a that's not a healthy way to do things. Uh, oh, what about a flat car? Uh, steel and goods? Nope. Uh, what about a bi-level auto rack? Machines and goods. It, it's getting worse. Uh, the Gunderson is probably probably as good as any. Goods. No. No Gunderson to the radio. The Chinese flat wagon. Come on, if I'm breaking all the rules, I'll, I'll break them good. Uh, steel and planks, no plastic. Now, you don't need both plastic and steel. You can either use uh, plastic and planks or steel and planks, if my memory serves correctly. So I, I could probably... I mean, I want, I'd quite like to run something I haven't before, or at least haven't used recently. And this only does 120. So steel, planks, goods... All right, let's let's just double check that we uh, that, oh, really you're going to keep all the menus up while surfing across the map. That's how I roll, baby. Uh, just uh, you just got a deal. I, have I? Yes, you do. Uh, right. Okay. So recipes are yeah, planks and steel will generate goods. All right then. Well, that's that's disappeared, hasn't it? Yeah, you, you, you're going to need to get that back up again and bang some more bits on it. Uh, come here, I want to bang some more bits on it, please. Bang some bits, bang, bits, bits, bang. That's that's not going to do it. No, no, you're going to have to go and talk to the depot some more. How does one buy trains? There's a big button there that's that's got the, uh, the, the text that you were looking for. Right, okay, so... Uh, steel, planks, goods. It does 100. You'll know, we decided not to go with you. Steel, planks, no, and... Yeah, I know. I'm going to repeat myself, and you're going to like it. Uh, where I was looking at the something. Steel, no. Uh, no. Uh, this one. Right, it does 120. It might only be a flat wagon, but it is Chinese, and therefore that's, that's interesting. Uh, right, okay. Well, let's uh, give you 400 metres worth of that. 324. Yeah, yeah. Go on. There you go. That's respectable. Uh, you'll do. Right. Acme to Art Hub. Uh, okay. There's nothing if not uh, not variety going on in today's show. Right. Let's go and say hello to this one. There you are. I, I mean, these wagons are not necessarily in the best order ever, but, uh, uh, but they apparently will get the job done. And uh, they're giving me they're giving me a capacity of four hundred odd. Now all of this is going to be quite expensive if nothing ever happens. 
but I think I think that's very unlikely. Right, what have we got? Uh, what have we got waiting here? Have we got N N Y Actuon? Actually, I'm going to name that again while it's uh, it's relatively fresh in my mind. Arc Hub. There you go. Nothing as yet, but uh, we're going to give it some bedding in time because uh, because we're generous like that. Uh, there's a good chance that we get some stone coming up because I'm about to hook up this fella here. Uh, now, that's relatively straightforward. It's just uh, slag stone construction material. So let's set the route. Uh, and I'll have, I'm actually going to have this sharing a platform as well uh, because I've still got one of arguably the most important to do. Uh, but here we go. We go from stag out to the arc hub. And you, I don't want you sharing that one because that's a through train. So we'll go for, what do we think, seven or eight? Uh, let's go for eight. Okay, you've still got six available. That's okay. I'll use I'll use six for the uh, for the next one, um, and that's going to be uh, supply. Yeah, stag, stag, arc hub. Cool. You you brought up another line there. Did you, did you mean to do that? Not especially, but uh, it doesn't really doesn't really matter. It's not gonna it's not gonna ruin my day. Uh, we definitely need more signals on this route. Okay. If we, you know, if we're expecting new friends, we should uh, we should prepare for their arrival. There you go. That hasn't interfered, has it? No, it hasn't. Okay, and then we'll do another set just outside here. Now I know that's right next to the platform, uh, but even so, it, it'll, it'll help in terms of keeping things shuffling along nicely. Uh, we'll stick one there, but not the other side because there's a set of points. Uh, let's do one here. We've already got some there. Get rid of that one. Yeah, that's good. Should probably get rid of this one as well. Otherwise, you'll you'll end up with some points blocking going on. Uh, and then this chap, he doesn't give a monkey's really. He's got he's got double track to himself. But we will stick a signal there. Uh, and then on the way back out from here, we'll stick one on there too. Okay, right now, as if that was whoa. Hold on. You can't get from Stag Industries 1, which should be a doddle, because you go around the helix here. Look, it's beautiful. Uh, back to... Ah, the only thing that that could possibly be due to is me having put a signal somewhere stupid a minute ago. Yeah, that's, that's quite possible. Okay, well, hold on. Yep, something else is reporting breakage, although that's possibly this one that I'm looking at now. Okay, interesting. What have I done? I've, I've, I mean, it's... Ah, oh, no, I know what I've done. Uh, it's because I just put a one-way signal down. There you go. Right, okay, thank you. Yeah, good. That's why I don't like one-way signals. And yet I do like one-way signals. And yet I don't. Right, put that there. Stick that on there. Everybody's happy. You can stop complaining now. Uh, right, back to the, uh, back to the, the train supermarket. And uh, let's buy another one. Uh, now, you are very, this is a straightforward uh, Conmats train, so uh, what do we like this time? Uh, well, it's got quite a long way to go, and some of it's uphill, so the extra... Someone said, can you put a GG1 on there? To which I went, oh, well, it's really old, but I'm going... You know what, If given how eclectic this station is going to be, I actually don't have a good argument against it. Um... That doesn't mean I should do it. It just means I don't have a good argument not to do it. Uh, they're, they're cheap, too, despite the fact... I mean, they came into service in 1936, uh, but it's still a good uh, a good loco. Now, I mean, this, this Spanish fella here would be terrific were it not for the fact it does 256 kilometres an hour. And therefore, although it only runs... It only costs 263... 2.6 2 million a year only. Um, no, I'm going to stick a Freightliner on there, um, just because I don't think I've run one recently. I mean, the, the rail iron's good, but, uh, way fast. I've got nothing that'll, I've got nothing that'll do it, um, wagon-wise. Uh, same as the, uh, the Regio jet. 
Uh, I've got I've got nothing that will keep pace with it. But you were just talking about putting that Spanish fella on there. Don't uh, don't conflate uh, a moment of whimsy with uh, with a, a solid plan. No, we're going this way. Uh, right. How much do they cost to run? Hundred uh, one point five six. It's fine. And then on here you've got uh, stone slag con mats. They're boring. They're gondolas. They're going to do the job for me. We'll use the red ones at least, uh, and uh, have four hundred meters worth. There we go. Right. You, that's too many. One too many there. And, uh, what's that? Two eighty eight. Yeah. Okay. That'll be fine. Um, and then uh, you are what stag arc hub. Okay. Stag arc hub. Now the the problem I'm going to get off this. Uh, supply stag arc up. Thank you. Um, is that uh, the raw materials for this are going to come from New York. Now, I don't doubt for a moment that they're actually going to start being delivered. That's easy. Um, the, and also, because I'm running a hopper that also stops there with uh, iron on board, then actually, what I was about to say was I might need to run a second train up there for that delivery purpose. I possibly won't. Uh, right, let's have a look and see what we've got going on. Um, right, okay, shuttle, New New York Arc Hub has wanted... It, it wants some plastic. Well then, you shall have some plastic, princess, and, uh, and it'll turn out just dandy for you. Um, I don't doubt that in the slightest. Uh, Lindholm near New York. Now, Lindholm is the one that's slightly further afield. I hope I'm not cannibalizing that one completely, because that will not be ideal. But we'll, we'll see how we get on. Now, the only thing that I haven't managed to secure yet is planks of any kind. Uh, yes. And that's going to be a problem, because I've, uh, I've got a service here that needs them, and I've got a service here that needs them. Uh, now, plastic, or does it? No, you can get away with just using steel plastic on there. Okay, all right. Well, the roots, the roots in use. Um, now, if I were to look the other way, uh, would, I mentioned this before briefly. Uh, was I need a I need a lumber mill, uh, and I need one somewhere useful, as in. You know, within a thousand miles of here would be perfect uh, for this particular scenario. Uh, we've got lumber that is unclaimed there. We've got more that here. Uh, I'm not seeing one. Oh, there's one there, but it's that's a long way to go. Is it in use at the moment? Yes, it is. Um, all right, you've got another one here, and that's already in use. Yes. Uh, tell you what, we're going to call up the industries list and uh, and work off that instead. So what we're after is uh, is this chap here. Now then, any of these look like they might not be being used. Uh, Little China is definitely in use. The fog is definitely in use. Uh, but let's see where they are. Uh, Precinct thirteen is underused, arguably. Oh, why won't you let me have more than one up at once? Well, actually, there's a trick to doing that. You just drag it over there, and uh, and then you can have as many up as you feel like. Right, okay, and then uh, the fog as well. All right, okay, well, right, talk to me. Where are you? Hello, I'm away. Okay, yeah, you're not it. Uh, Precinct 13? Right, okay, that's... Closer, but awful. And Little China, who has been complaining quite a bit, uh, is closer... Clo yeah, arguably, it's closer. Um, but it's just it's just not good. However, I think... Didn't I already have a goods route along here somewhere? Well, that's a good strain look. Because um, we've got here... And I could easily extend out across the uh, across the river from here. Um, maybe maybe get a hook up onto the onto the main bridge. Uh, there's a there's a lot of track 
that is just <laughs> just just merrily wending its way uh, throughout the uh, throughout the known universe. Uh, yeah, well, I mean that could end up being my uh, my my secret weapon into this extra track here. Uh, what's that? Uh, eight seven six five platform five. It could it could do that. All right. So if you're coming out this way, then you're going to reappear there. So you're going to want to put in a, another line for the lumber you've got there. You could truck that. I could truck that. Or you could train it. But that connection is going to be complicated, to say the least. Uh, right, okay. So then, then we're all about getting this onto there. Uh, and that's the passenger route, so we actually want it over the far side to get onto the goods route. Well, you know what? I've done stupider things. Um, I've done more uh, more creative things than that uh, previously, so uh, let's have a look. Right, what do you got here? We're not even we're not even using that side. Then uh, then that's that's what we're going to do now. How are you going to do that? Well, okay, pulse racing time again. Let's uh, let's have a look. Uh, so you're going to want to come off from that side of the bridge, and then we could probably, I mean, we could get underneath the uh, the, the bridge that we've got there now. <laughs> yeah, we could. Uh, what did I decide on? Little China, which is just outside Mega City One. It's a bit of a hike. But it's uh, but it's going to be it's going to be ruddy exciting is what it's going to be. We could also then pull this oil on there as well. I mean, why am I getting carried away? Stop getting carried away. We do, this is a this is not a brilliant plan. Uh, I want you to be aware of how unbrilliant this plan is because you're going absolutely miles. But it it does tick the box of we're going to try and connect everything up. Um, and look at me pulling up a station already. It's, it's like I've already decided that this is happening. Uh, that's probably because this is happening. Right, okay, now then, station. Hello, right, now, will you do this, or shall I pull out the uh, the rather magnificent new bulldozing tool uh, and, uh, and get to work? I mean, the bulldoze, this bulldozing tool is so good, it's cheating. Uh, that's that's what it is. I mean, you know, you have to pay for it still, but uh, I think I just might have gone past it while talking. You haven't. Keep going, then. It'll be in here somewhere. Why don't you just look it up on the one that it's on? Because I don't know which one it's on. So, uh, so therefore, I'll go through all of it. Right, okay, now then, if we do... Uh, let's try that to about there, and then over some... You're going to need to go further than that, man. There you go, to about there to about here and then push the button level it okay right well i mean it's, that's all on the level now this this road's upset uh, but uh, i imagine with a bit of smoothing here that'll that'll sort itself out no no what you imagined is is an untruth uh, right well okay well in which case we'll, we'll just we'll just fix it it's okay there's no need to worry uh, bulldoze Yep, and then uh, and then we'll just fix it like that. See, smoothed it straight back out again. Right, station. There you go. Bang you in the end here. You better not complain because uh, I just made a right hole. Um, yeah, we'll use the uh, we'll use the terminus. We only need one track. Uh, we do need four hundred meters of uh, of that though. Uh, and that's not going to work. Well, okay. Given that it's a backing service, we don't need four hundred meters of that. Can we get away with 360? No, you're going to have to do some more bulldozing. Well, okay. I mean, I'm I don't mind doing a bit more bulldozing, but uh, but when it comes down to it, I'd I'd rather not because uh, I'm going to have to do some terraforming on here afterwards to make it look better. Uh, right. Okay. Grab one from there. Uh, oh, oh, back to plan. Thank you. Uh, this one. Yeah. That. There. Voila punch it right okay now if you can't get a station in it see what i mean by by cheating it has taken all of the artistry out of uh, out of coming up with a junction um i just made it really 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 easy uh and you know 
I may I may tend towards uh, easier moves once in a while, but I do you know I don't want to erode all the challenge. That's why I don't play with no costs. No cost is no fun um, because you you've already won. Congratulations. The challenge comes from can I earn enough to actually keep all of this afloat? Because the one thing you can't do is run uh, an incredibly unprofitable network for too long before the whole thing falls apart. Uh, so you've you've got to you've got to at least put a nod towards uh, towards making that work. Right, keep going. Go on, 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 go on. Yeah, there's there's going to need to be there's going to need to be some concealment uh, via the tree gun to make that happen. Right, we're going from here out to there. Okay, let's go. Yeah, no, I'm not I'm I'm not going to be subtle about it. I'm going to come straight in like this. Uh, that appears to be fine. What have we got there? You've got a bit of tunnel. We've got some bridge going on. All right, okay. Well, let's select a bridge that isn't odious. And make sure the bridge itself isn't horrendous. Oh, no, that's all right. Um, let's use something just a little bit out of the ordinary. Do you feel like, do you feel like playing? There you go. You're a little out of the ordinary. Yeah, accept that. Thank you. Right. Uh, and then the complicated bit is not actually that complicated. All we've got to do is just uh, create a set of points here. Uh, let's get rid of that signal. There you go. No, no, just the signal. Thank you. Uh, and then uh, where's that off over here? Do we want to double track it? No, no, no. We'll, uh, will we? No, we'll run this single track. It'll be fine. Um, all right, so we'll just we'll just take a set of points off from there and connect it up and build a bridge. Oh, all right, what are you using there? Oh, your your new favourite. There you go. Do that bit of solid concrete number. All right, then it comes up here. We bang a signal along to make sure that uh, that everybody can just get along with one another, like that. And then we'll swing through onto this interior platform here. Uh, and then we'll swing out from there and hopefully connect up over there somewhere. No chance. There is no chance that is going to work. Well, uh, also, I don't know if you're going to get altitude enough to uh, to not adversely affect the uh, the water service that's going on here. Well, that's a bridge already, isn't it? Yes, but you're going to need to turn on shipping lanes. All right, well, if we just hoik this directly across... How bad is it? Well, it's broken. That's how bad it is. Okay, all right. Well, you know, that was only the, that was just a speculative. Uh, let's now go up some. In fact, no, let's not. Let's do this. Two, three. I think four is four enough. Uh, it might be as long as you don't try and clip to the flipping road. Right. How's that? Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, you can get a ship under there. Um, the only thing that's that's then going to be challenging is is getting a getting a connection across because we want these far far lines over there. Uh, now we could do an interior tunnel connection, but you know I don't like doing those. Um, I don't want to run it as its own line because uh, I, I was going to say reasons, but. Um, but no, actually, I don't like running individual lines when there's a perfectly serviceable line that is not, as you can plainly see, currently chock-a-block with trains. Uh, the, the aim is it becomes chock-a-block with trains due to my interference. Let's get rid of that. And then let's see how horrendous this is going to be. Okay, well, 60s okay i suppose you are going to need to double slip it because you're running two-way services on there so that means this is going to interfere with the existing smooth operation of things thank you shade uh, you have now created a lump under the tunnel well that was that was inevitable and i'm going to ignore it uh i had enough i had enough fretting at that kind of behavior last time um, right, okay, 76 is okay, that's fine, let's get rid of this bit of road, someone's going to start complaining, but I'll put it back in, don't worry, uh, I'm not trucking stuff around there at the moment, no, or if I am, I'm, I'm foolish to do so, and then we'll run that down there, line it up quite nicely, 
All right, it's abrupt, I'll tell you that, but uh, it is going to do the job. Um, yeah, now, you were, you were you're about to say something akin to, uh, we'll make it work to start with, and then, yeah, right? Um, and then make it pretty afterwards. But in all honesty, I don't think you are, are you? I think you're, the likelihood that you uh, you make it less ugly later on is somewhere between slim and none. We'll match the uh, the the bridge pillar type there and keep it upright. You're going to have to get across the water, though. Okay. Well, you could just do a raised section in the middle of the water. And why would I do that? Let's see if that's going to be high enough. So we've got the line about right. Uh, if I go as far as there... Well, if I go all the way across, have we still... Yeah, we've still got a shipping route, and that's connected up quite nicely. The only connection I'm a bit dubious about is this one over here. Um, but it's... I mean, it's practical, even if it is not glamorous. Uh, could I do this any faster? Given that this tunnel entrance is already wrecked, could I do it faster? You're going to need to double slip there as well, which is going to make it even more ugly, I'm sure. Uh, no, less ugly, but still ugly. Well, um, yeah. So, well, you can tell you what, kill off Precinct 13 while you're at it. Uh, yeah. How are we going to make this work then? Uh, well, first off, let's put a one way signal on there. Uh, right. And then we'll stick another one on there as well. Inside the tunnel. Yeah, that's not fatal. Um, and then we'll put a two-way signal on here. Now, the only difficulty you're going to get from that is that I'm only allowed to run one train at a time. So it's going to need to be a serious train and as fast as I can get it. And there's a really loud voice in my head saying, Big boy! Uh, to which I would say, Yeah, maybe, but the problem you've got there is that the big boy is no longer available. Um... Oh, I know. We're all disappointed by that. Do you really want to put signalling on there? That's the passenger service. You don't really want to hold that up. It'll be fine. Uh, yeah, yeah, it'll be good. Don't worry. Um, right. Okay, well, in theory, that sh Have I just done that entire route? Yeah. Okay, well, in theory, we can now go from uh, the Arc Hub. I'm, I'm going to make this a stop. Or is that foolish? No, let's see what happens. Um, uh, the arc up to there, and then <laughs> where does it go? It comes up here, right? Okay, uh, and then out as far as uh, whatever this is called. This is uh, Little China, um, right? Now Little China has been complaining a lot, so uh, so you never know. Uh, this this might make it happy about life. Uh, you've also got a truck stop there, so this could have unintended additional bonuses it might not have unintended additional bonuses but it, it could have um so there you go so because i'm single tracking this the entire distance uh then there is the there is the very real possibility that it uh uh that it can't it can't do the pace um anyway let's uh let's get it going all right supply yeah, no, that's it. That's that's that sorted now. I just need to set the end platform for it, but it looks like from here it might have already done that. Uh, little China, uh, China to the Arc Hub. Um, this is uh, yeah, this this is all terribly experimental. Um, okay, right, good. There, you are. I need a train. What does it? What does this train need to carry? Well, it needs to carry something. Uh, not that one. That one is a through route. Yeah, no, yeah, you're not allowed that one. You can go on the on the next one over. So that's going to be uh, five. There you go. Brilliant. Well, okay, brilliant. Very strong word. Uh, there you go. Adequate. All right, that's fair. Um, right. Okay. Now we need to fling a train up that one as well. I am getting through the routes today. Uh, and that's a that's a very good thing. I've no idea where the trains have got to, of course, but uh, I'm getting through the routes. Oh, look, there's some, there's some action. Uh, you've got a couple of trains going on there. Yeah, good action. Like it. Um, right. What are we going to do this time? 
uh, I'm gonna make uh, gonna make life easy on myself. Let's go electric with this. This one needs to this one needs to haul, right? This one, we need to be quick with this. I'll find the well. Let's start with the wagons then. Um, so you're talking planks and lumber primarily, but if it happens to pick up something else, the world doesn't end. These do it. One sixty. Yeah, all right. And then we'll stick a one sixty loco on there. I don't think I've got any goods wagons that are faster than that. Uh, if I have, then I will entertain them as a potential guest. Um, but I don't believe I've got anything that will do it. 113, 113. Uh, those do 160 as well. They don't carry what I want, but I did, we're just, it's more about looking at the speed. Uh, 120. No, I think we've, uh, I think we've got a winner. Uh, either that or the regular state cars. <laughs> Who wants to use a regular state car when you have so many other things? What about the Nafis Universal? No. I've got this far without using them. I'll uh, I'll continue without using them. Oh, and uh, Autosave has popped its head around the corner to go, You alright? I go, yeah, yeah, I'm alright. Yeah, it's, it's all good. It's all good. Uh, what about this nice looking Deutsche Bahn? No, it's only 120. Uh, okay. All right, there you go. What about this other nice-looking Deutsche Bahn? That's also only 120. Pennsylvania flat car, 127. Oh, controversial. No, okay, right. Well, we've got our winner then, and uh, let's go with the blue one, uh, the the Lorenberg and Southern, because I don't think I've used that one before. I think I've used all of the others. Uh, right, okay. So let's get this up to 300 and change. Uh, right, okay. Now get back back there you go uh that gives me 432 in capacity that's not bad and then we need a, a loco capable of 160 or better uh i'm open to off i'll tell you what because this is running slightly weird route we'll run a slightly weird loco on there i'm talking to you there johnny spanish uh I'm a little concerned about your tractive effort, but your overall hauling power seems to be respectable. So let's uh, let's grab that, um, and then you can go on Little China. Okay, supply Little China to uh, the Ark Hub. Okay, right, and that's that's all she wrote. Well, it's not all she wrote. She wrote quite a lot, but uh, that's all she wrote for the moment. There we go. This uh, I'm I'm hoping given its top speed and its power rating and what have you, that its acceleration is going to be relatively good. Um, I, uh, I, I have to apologise temporarily at the moment, because uh, if you are hearing uh, some atmospheric special effects in the background, it's because uh, we are having weather here that is closely approximate to the end of times. Uh, so anything could happen in the near future. I'm hoping uh, that one of the things that happen is not that this recording cuts out. Tell you what, I'll put a break in here. And with that, the atmospherics had all stopped outside, but uh, I'm taking no chances. What we don't want is to uh, is to lose everything that we've done so far. Right, any news here? Oh, uh, yes, quite a lot of news. We've got stone and plastic in high quantities uh, waiting to be shipped out to the Ark Hub, which is pretty good. Um, anybody else picking up yet? Uh, I find it hard to know. No, I, I was about to find it hard to believe, but I. But apparently not. Uh, we've now got uh, planks waiting to be delivered. That's that's good. Um, now, given that you've got a truck route here to drop planks off, uh, to drop uh, raw lumber off, I wonder if that's going to be enough of a supply. Um, but given that I'm stopping at this uh, interstitial service, it means that I've also got uh, interstitial platform. Station. Yeah, it's a station. means that I've also got other choices as far as, uh, as where we can get lumber from. So what I think I'll do is I'll create another train route out to this place here, which is the Uberwald. Uh, and we'll, we won't do that today. We'll do that next time. I want to see how, uh, how we're progressing. Uh, so we'll we'll Uberwald in here and make a drop, um, and uh, and then we will uh, we'll truck out uh, from here over to the hub. Yeah, all right, okay. So we'll get the truck route going now because there's uh, you know that's nice and quick. Uh, but I you know we're we're going to do a kind of progress assessment. Um, 
because the the main aim now is going to be to uh, to kind of get a feel for okay is anything actually working then uh what do we got here this is murkwood it's full of elves uh, murkwood good okay yep fine and that's that's an easy one to set up although it's it's quite a quite a languid route we've got here but uh that's okay. Now, where did that line one that was uh, unassigned go? Well, it's going to be on an L, isn't it? L, I, L, I. That's what you're looking for. No, nope. did I use it? Let's say yes. Uh, right. Okay. Let's go for all right from the uh, from the hub out to Mirkwood, and that's quite straightforward. Is that this is uh, supply uh, Mirkwood to Arc Hub, right? Good. Marvellous. How many do you want on there? I think we're going to need four. Maybe more than that, but uh, but four will certainly suffice uh, for uh, for uh, for getting started purposes. Uh, you're going to you're going to carry lumber only, so we could use a lumber truck. You would be absolutely super for this if you actually carried logs, and you don't. Uh, what about the man with the curtain side? Nope. Uh, nope, no, nope, no. Nope. If uh, if you're not interested in carrying the stuff I need to carry, we will go back to generic land. Uh, livestock tankers. No, uh, I'm not seeing any. I'm not seeing any volunteers at the moment, other than the obvious ones. Uh, no. All right. Well, if we've got no volunteers, then we'll we'll stick obvious. Uh, let's go Union Pacific. No, let's go Taco Bell with this one. Uh, one, two, three, four. And then set that one onto Mirkwood, matey boy. Uh, supply M. Yes, there you go. Right, good. Okay, now then, that's going to lead to an interesting state of affairs where we've got uh, where we've got lumber appearing here, ready to be processed, uh, and then potentially that new train that we just literally just set in motion uh, could well come back with some lumber. In which case we get an awful lot of goods starting to be produced. Now, the, the, the last line that we need in order to make this work uh, is not the last line, but it is one that we need to make it work, is, uh, is delivery to Arkham. So we need a generic delivery service uh, that heads into Arkham on this side. So I've got to do a bit of bulldozing here in order to make this work. Sorry, locals, but uh, I should have thought this through. So we'll do that. It's going to make me tunnel horrible. It is, isn't it? Uh, can we go a little bit later and uh, and still get round? Well, if you go from this side, you'll see how early, you, how, well, how late you can go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right there. No, oh, look at it. Look, it's making horror. Horror is going to occur. Oh, why do you do this? All right, well, let's try and get ahead of the curve on it and... Uh, if we smooth some of this out, maybe it won't respond quite so vigorously. Sorry, I saw it. Oh, look at this. Uh, <laughs> gonna go. Smoothing guns out. Right, what needs smoothing? Everything. Everything needs smoothing. Smooth it all. Uh, right, okay, here we go. Brace yourselves. If this works, I'll be happy. But uh, I mean, Obviously, the connection will work, but what I don't want is the horror. Oh, the horror. Oh, why... Yeah, all right. Stick it in. Let's see. Let's see the full horror. Oh goodness me, that's repellent. No, I'm making a feature out of this town. I can't have a flipping great lump of ugly sat in the middle of it. You know, I'll tolerate an occasional wiggly bit of track or a bump in the road or something along those lines, and even then, I won't tolerate it very willingly. Uh, but what I will not tolerate is that. So what we will uh, endeavour to do is uh, is relay it and then build the tunnel last. Don't you dare. Oh, that's because there's some track there. All right, okay. All right, tunnel goes in last. Don't, don't think about going uphill. That's not a thing yours to think about. Just keep going forwards. There you go, keep going. Don't tunnel yet. Right, okay, that's good. And then whack this through as well. There you go. Right, and then you make your connection. 
There you go. I don't care how slowly you're doing it. That's uh, that's of lesser importance. And then, do not disappoint me. To there. Terrain alignment collision. No, it's it's not though, is it? Stop going uphill. Okay, now you don't want to build a tunnel at all. I don't want to do a tunnel. All right, we'll try going the other way. Out to there. We've got a terrain alignment collision because it's trying to do the tunnel too far back. Right. I think your life is forfeit anyway, Sunshine, so uh, sorry about that. Uh, maybe if I did a little bit of, uh, of, of gentle uh, height increase here, we could get a bit of tunnel in beforehand. Like that, you see? Yeah. There you are. It's just about encouraging it to tunnel earlier. And there we go. <laughs> I win. Yeah. All you people can just not win. Uh, you've already double slipped that, which means that that's not going to be a problem either. And you have evaded the ugly. You've got a tiny little lump there that we're not going to interfere with because in doing so would be to tempt fate. Uh, so we'll stick that on there and we'll make sure this is two-way, which it is, and we'll stick that there. Uh, and then because I'm feeling generous, I'll put one there too. Right, okay, now check everything's rolling on the correct side of the track. No, something weird's happening. Or is it? What's this brown number doing? No, 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 no. Mm, yes, but why? Why have you? Why have you switched track? Uh, Oi, Brown, who are you? What are you playing at? Uh, is it this one, or is it this one? It shouldn't be either of them. Um, I mean, a, a one-way signal will sort that straight out, uh, but. Wherever I put... Oh, no, hold on. We could get a signal in there. Uh, stick a one way on there. About there. There you go. Do it properly. Don't uh, don't start taking liberties, because uh, uh, we don't have any in stock. Uh, right, okay. So, we're going from Arkham Freight. No, we're not. Yes, we are. We're going from Arkham Freight, and we're heading up to here. Uh, and this is what I was reserving Platform 6 for. Uh, Arkham Freight Platform 6. No, that doesn't have a Platform 6. Back to 1. Uh, it might not be 1. I think it's 3. Got it. No, it's not 3. It might be 2. I don't really know. This one's 6, though. Uh, let's go just double-check you haven't made a mess of that. Uh, there. Right. Is that not a platform? Surely it is. Uh, right, come here. Terminals, yes. Platform three. Uh, should, uh, if that's one, then uh, why you know that's two. It hasn't got three platforms. That's a, is that a passing track? Yes, you've got a passing track in the middle. Oh dear. Yes. Oh dear. Ah. No, it's it's fine. It's fine actually. Uh, right. In which case, you stop on one. There you go. Yeah, that'll be fine. It, 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 no, it is fine. Uh, so this is going to be uh, delivery. Uh, Arc Hub. Just, just call it Arkham, man. Just, just call it Arkham. You'll be fine. Right, and that needs to be something relatively uh, universal-esque. Uh, yes, it does. Yes, it does. Uh, that's fine. We can we can make that work. We're, uh, this is turning into a rather an extended episode here today, uh, but that's okay because I'm almost done for today. Uh, let's set everything back in motion again, and I'll up the tempo uh, while we're not looking directly at stuff. In fact, I'll well up the tempo while we're not looking at stuff, so that there's a really good chance that uh, that we've got some chaps waiting for us when we arrive. Um, right. Okay. So by a train. What does this need to be? Well, we can go a bit slower with this one, so we can use something that we haven't done for a while. You sure? Yeah, let's go for... Uh, yeah, let's use one of these uh, one of these uh, Antipodeans. Okay. Right, and then on the back of that, what are you going to stick on it? Some wagons? Oh, you've, you've thought this through then. Uh, right, so you're going to need... 
Tools machines, we're getting. Food, we're not. That's not... No, it hasn't got enough coverage. I think we might end up with the Gunderson on this. Um, there's the Gunderson. Uh, yes, tools, machines. Uh, fuel is going to come in. Construction materials are going to come in. And goods are going to come in. And food, possibly, maybe. Okay, we're going to go Gunderson. I know we've used it quite a lot. But, uh, but it is appropriate in this situation. We're only going to run 300 metres of it. Which is probably more than we need, given it's got a capacity of 470. Um, but uh, yeah, no, that's going to be—it's going to be fine. Uh, so this is Supply Arkham, which doesn't appear to be listed. Why is that then? Why are you not listed? Maybe I put a semicolon, a colon in the wrong place or something. No. Why is it not listed? Delivery, delivery Arkham. Okay, fine. Few. Uh, I thought for a moment there I'd made an egregious error, but uh, I haven't made an egregious error. Everything is absolutely delightful. Uh, right, okay, you're rocking and a rolling. I do like this Gunderson wagon. Uh, Arkham is no longer connected to Winchesterton Field, Bill. Uh, that'll be the bit of road that I deleted and said I was going to put back in. That's, that's fine. Uh, we'll we'll do that. Uh, it's not this bit of bridge, though, is it? It's It was... Is it this bit that I've... There's obviously some severance going on in there. I don't think it's any of those. I think we're looking at somewhere weird. Uh, all right, close that up. Um, where the heck am I? There you go, it's over here. Uh, and it's this bit of road. Okay, fine. Uh, country road. Uh, let's go for some medium. Can we swing it under? We can. We can swing it under there. That's not going to be a problem. Right. Swing it under. What do you mean collision? Don't talk nonsense. Uh, and then swing it around to here. Swing. Get swung. And then under there. Go on. You'll get under there. Go on. You're, it's fine. Go on. That's it. Like that. Yeah. Lovely. Uh, and then uh, make a connection. And then you stop complaining. No warnings. Yeah. Darn tootin' there are no warnings. It's because I'm that good. Uh, right, okay, let's see what's going on over here. Uh, so, well, as you can plainly see, we've 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 got some activity going on. Uh, who's this here? What are you? You are Acme to Arc Hub. So you're going to be picking up the parts in order to make some uh, uh, some goods. Or there is the other alternative where you don't do that because you haven't got any steel uh, or timber at the moment. But plastic is a thing that... Uh, well, we had a bunch of plastic coming out this way, so uh, so presumably it's just not... Uh, it's not queued. It's already at the, at the destination. But we've got, uh, we've got cold materials that are ready to rock and roll. Uh, that's pretty good. I think those go in the in the gondola as well. Or do they? No, I don't think they do. But that's fine. They can they can ride back on the new New York service. So that's good. We've got lumber waiting to go. Blimey. Actually, I've got a lot of lumber waiting to go. That didn't take long to pick up. Um, all right. Okay. Now, as we move down to our next service here, are you interested? They're interested. What have you got in so far? Nothing. Okay, well, keep your fingers crossed. Uh, and then as we move further afield, uh, how about you? You are also coiled and ready to rock and roll. You've got nothing. Good, good, good. Right, okay, now then, what about you? Oh, there, oh, this, is, this is working tremendously already. That's, that's great. Uh, and there you go, that's going to that's gonna wrap it up. Oh, we've turned up at just the right time. In order to see the, uh, the the top end of the helix come around, you want to ride on board, okay? It's not. There's just not much to see. That's the thing. Is uh, is you go round in a circle with uh, arguably too small a texture to uh, to keep it interesting. Uh, we'll emerge into the sunlight in a moment, and then we'll be back in for some more uh, as we do 76 kilometres an hour. But I'll leave you with it anyway because you know it's going to make you happy i hope anyway i've been colonel failure thank you very much for watching today we're not done with arkham there's at least oil still to work on uh and then 
there is the challenge of uh, getting the goods that were developed here out to Gotham. Yeah, because Gotham's next door and they're not getting any goods at all yet. So I've got to, I've got to sort that out. Uh, while we're on the subject of places that don't have any goods yet, you've also got Caprica to worry about. Oh dear. Really? Do I want to make this the, uh, the, the how do we solve Caprica? No, I really don't. Mixture of mixture of both slag and stone there. That's good. How are you doing? How are you doing for money? I'm making some. This is a suitable answer. Are you going to be taking some goods back with you? Yes, I am. Then you are another profitable service. I'm I'm making a dirty habit out of profitable services lately, and I like it. Anyway, thanks very much for watching today. I've been Colonel Failure. Um, uh, I'm I'm rather enjoying just tinkering around here. It's uh, it's proving to be quite good fun. Uh, I do hope you'll join me for the next episode. Uh, subscribe to ensure that you don't miss it, and uh, and I'll be back with more of the same soon. Thanks for watching. Cheerio. Well, I have to say I'm absolutely delighted with the mysteries that Arkham has unveiled. Uh, initially, this was thought to be just a you know a couple of episode diversion to maybe cook cook up cook up hook up one or the other, uh, a couple of the missing industries. Uh, but it's turned out to be the gift that keeps on giving in terms of opportunity, I, I think. Um, uh, connecting it up now to uh, to Gotham and then possibly to Caprica is uh, is going to be interesting uh, and challenging. And uh, and I'm looking forward to doing it. It's, uh, it's, it's jolly good stuff. Uh, I may have a poke around the workshop for a couple more locos to choose from. I, I think that, that there may be other opportunities out there. Anyway, do stick around, because this is the good stuff. Uh, the rest of it is, it, it's all the, the prelude to this magnificent finale uh, for the series, which will happen in the next, I don't know, week or two. Uh, there we go. Um, yeah, I'll catch up with you next time. Thanks for watching. Cheerio.